you take it out, pick it out, figure it out. Figure it out. What's up, everybody? It's me, Cornbread. That's right. And we are back with another math problem. All right. So, are y'all ready to do this thing? All right. Here we go. So, today, we are talking about something I know everyone is familiar with, and that is time. Yes. All right. Oh, and before we get started, let me introduce you to my friend, Megan. Yeah, there she goes. She can play the guitar. Can you believe it? Man, let me tell you this story about when, um, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Let me get back to the problem. So, Megan met her best friend at a restaurant at 324, okay? Then they left at 352. How long did Megan and her friend stay at the restaurant? Now, it's no need to stress, because I know you're going to get the answer, okay? Oh, and remember, you are a master mathematician. So just think about all the things that you've learned, okay? You have your parents, you have your friends, you have everything at your disposal. That's right. So put those thinking caps on, and you are a winner. Wait a minute, let me see what my friend doing. Yep, okay, he's showing his work, all right. All right, now let me see what my other two friends, they working in groups. Okay, yep, both of them. Yep, she's showing her, yep, and she's showing hers. Good job, all right. All right, y'all ready for the answer? All right, so you know how we do it. Now, it's time for us to count down from 10. Are y'all ready? All right, here we go. And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, answers! Ah, uh, yeah, math detectives, you did it. The answer is 28. And remember, there's no problem too hard for you to solve. It only takes time and determination. That's right, because you all are what? Math detectives. And hey, you're making your teachers real proud. They call him Cornbread, the math detective. Figure it out, figure it out, figure it out. I can figure out what this problem's all about. They call him Cornbread, the math detective. Figure it out, And don't forget to subscribe, y'all.